The interim government of Bangladesh, led by Mohammad Yunus, is set to scrutinize Indian businesses, including the Adani Group. At the center of the review is a 2017 power purchase agreement, under which Adani Power's Jharkhand unit exports almost 1,500 megawatt of electricity to Bangladesh. Now, the government is particularly interested in assessing the terms of the agreement and whether the price being paid for power is justified. Bangladesh has accumulated over $500 million in unpaid dues to Adani, a port of its $3.7 billion total power sector liabilities. Adani Power claims the dues are making operations unsustainable. The Adani Group's Goda power plant fully operational since april 2023 supplies about 7 to 10 percent of bangladesh's base load in 2023-24 alone it exported around 7508 million units of power to bangladesh amounting to nearly 63 percent of india's total power exports to the country while bangladesh purchases power from multiple indian companies adani's electricity power price stands out at 14.02 bangladeshi taka per unit significantly higher than other suppliers. As Bangladesh grapples with a mounting debt crisis, these figures have raised questions over the cost efficiency of the agreement. In response to the overdue payments and Bangladesh's power sector crisis, the Indian government amended regulations in August 2023 to allow Adani's Goda plant to sell power domestically if payments continue to be delayed. The Bangladesh interim government insists that this review of Indian contracts is not targeted at any specific company but is part of a broader effort to ensure compliance with local laws. The UNIS administration is also addressing concerns about corruption and financial mismanagement. During the tenure of ousted Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina with implications for the country's relationship with India.